can still spot many ex terrorists on the streets, and they usually look great. If you didn't know any better, you might think Nissan was still producing them. Despite discontinuation in most markets after 2015, with only the Middle East countries continuing sales, the familiar silhouette of the Xterra remains a testament to its enduring design. Fans have been on alert ever since the Nissan Terra appeared in China, but that's not the same SUV. Some of them have reported that local dealers are hinting at the comeback of the 2025 Xterra as a rival to the Wrangler, Forerunner, and Bronco. The resurrected model is also rumored to be a three-row SUV that might serve to refresh Nissan's lineup, offering an alternative to the now-aging Pathfinder. The big question is what will be under the hood of the new vehicle. Here is what we know about the 2025 Nissan Xterra. The new 2025 Nissan Xterra aims to fill the gap for an off-road SUV, or potentially step in as the successor to the Pathfinder. Maintaining its essence, the vehicle remains loyal to the body-on-frame construction that has defined its predecessor since inception. This durable build is synonymous with Xterra's adventurous spirit and reliability in challenging terrains. Key improvements on the Xterra should be seen in its on-road capabilities. However, its soul still lies in its capabilities off the beaten path. The underpinnings of the refreshed Xterra will probably be shared with the latest Frontier, which brings a promise of modernization and toughness. In response to evolving market demands, the new 2025 Xterra needs to be a slightly larger mid-size SUV, offering more space and comfort. As such, it falls into the contemporary trend for roomier vehicles. Whether a third row of seats will be included remains to be seen. Aesthetically, it needs a few unique design elements that differentiate it as an Xterra, while borrowing some features from its frontier cousin. The purpose will determine the type of engine the new 2025 Nissan Xterra will use. One of the main downsides and reasons for discontinuation was poor fuel economy. Nissan is known for its skeptical approach to the electrification of pickups and body-on-frame SUVs, so we are pretty sure that the new Xterra is about to stick with six cylinders. A 3.8-liter unit can provide an impressive 310 horsepower and 271 pound-feet of torque, matching the strength found in Frontier's lineup. The shift towards a more efficient hybrid system addresses the earlier model's criticisms regarding fuel economy without sacrificing power. Anchoring this advancement, a 9-speed automatic transmission is predicted to be mated to AV6. While enthusiasts typically favor the power of AV6, Nissan remains forward-thinking by reducing reliance on V8 engines, which are gradually phasing out in the industry. Instead, discussions suggest we may see the inclusion of a turbocharged V6, a strategic move that would elevate the Xterra's performance credentials. Not only would this turbo variant hold the potential for increased power, but it could also offer advancements in fuel efficiency, reflecting Nissan's commitment to innovation within their SUV range. A Turbo 4 would be a disappointment for all the fans, even though this configuration can deliver the same amount of power as AV6, but with better gas mileage. The Nissan Xterra, well known for its reliability, has been hinted to make a resurgence. Anticipation builds amongst off-roading enthusiasts and those in the market for a durable SUV. Should the Xterra return, it would offer a compelling option in the midsize SUV category, currently dominated by the likes of Toyota Highlander and Ford Explorer. Nissan's decision to revive the nameplate, even as an upgrade or even a replacement for the Pathfinder, suggests a strategic move to fortify its standing in a competitive segment. Enthusiasts and new customers may find the new Xterra to be a refreshing addition, eagerly awaited for its ability to navigate challenging terrains with ease. The automotive community watches with keen interest for an official announcement from Nissan. Subscribe to our channel not to miss any further updates. When the new Xterra is unveiled, we'll be there to provide you with full details.